It's the gardening episode! Finally! Welcome to Spyro Secret Club. I can do whatever I want here. Aww. Like this! No Ripto's allowed. What what are you doing in the corner there, Spyro? That's private. <laughs> don't, don't put it on YouTube then, you perv. <laughs> Let's Cloud go to church. Temples. You need Jesus. You need Jesus. <laughs> My cloud temples are oh. first to world in the winter tundra. It's uh, a bit of an odd one as well. It's about magic. Oh, so, it's, so it is. Yeah, Spyro, Spyro and magic go hand in hand. So dragons are inherently magical. That's just the truth. Yep. Oh. I mean, that's that's pretty mischievous and not that much as much evil, but. I respect it. Yeah, he's just out, out thinking the game. <laughs> like, if that guy doesn't beat Red with giant chomper teeth, he'd just be a, a scamp. Yeah. Well, such, such a sad wizard. Aww. I don't have arms or feet or nothing. I'm just a head in a robe. Look at that intense attack pattern. <laughs> oh yeah, but those enemies, uh, they have homing attacks. They're pretty dangerous. Uh -oh. But we're gonna... Like, those those, those flying platforms are very important. Yeah. Take note of them. They look important. Oh. They look magical. Get our shades back for this... Uh... Nice, nice level. Well, you know, when you're this high up in the mountains, you, you've got to UV protect your eyes or else you're going to get yeah. snowblind. Oh! <laughs> we're, we're immune during cutscenes, don't worry. It's fine. That big warlock over there stole my wand. He and his friends have used the magic within to oh, take over the city. You don't have hands, how can you use a wand? Also, you're apparently invulnerable to magic. Because he's a ghost wizard. Me to fight him, do you? You're the big tough dragon, right? Hey, but you're invincible to magic! Yeah, you, you can't, it literally can't hurt you. Ugh. <sighs> Whatever. What jerk. Class A jerk. What's, what wizardry did you study? Jerk, jerk, Mancy? Alright, we're gonna do something cool. Wait you ready? I'm ready. Oh, it's just like in my Japanese animes. It's pretty cool. Oh, it got cooler. Wow. Yeah, so those platforms, you have to take note of them. Like, it's, it's very, you have to do very specifically at this moment, that platform on the right there. You want to jump on that one because that one goes the highest. It's just like my Japanese anime. <laughs> yeah, oh. look at that again in slow motion. That's how cool it is. It's not cooler. And with that... Cool. Yeah, we can get up here, all the way out the top of, the, well, not all the way at the top, but pretty high up in the in the temples. Yeah, the top 5% of the level. Yeah. Now, can we get further from this, or are we invisible boxed from progressing? We're not, we're not completely invisible boxed. There is a way to, like, really quickly get to the end of the level, okay. we, but that's so <laughs> incredibly hard, <laughs> and I... I can tell you right away that I was not really successful. I will show you an attempt. Okay. <laughs> um, but we can we can go from through here. Um, we can see some of the level, and yeah. if if you were fast, you can just run run through all the roof, rooftops and get and fly down there and just skip like half the level. Yeah. Okay. It's a so pretty voluminous level. It's a lot of a lot of foot footage. It's not yeah, something so if can... after the things you've done, you're like this is the hard one. That's pretty hard. Let me find a nice spot, hiding spot. <laughs> but yeah, no, it's 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 seriously hard because like 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 this part already was was super hard yeah. and, and took like many hours and I like I did hundreds of attempts and I didn't get a successful attempt and eventually you know you, like a video has to go up a video has to be finished <laughs> yeah. so like I was not successful to do this but I can show you how it works. Um, Maybe successful attempt later, or just with level storage. Yeah. Um, show you out. But this, like, what you would do is like you would use a wall glide, oh. and there's that that hover that you saw was an automatic hover. 
what you what you would the, what you're supposed to do is just keep that auto glide that all that yeah that, just, um, just glide at that same level all the way around the mountain basically yeah all the way around until that building that you oh. see that in the background there that's the end of the level you would go through the wall get to the last enemy kill it and you would finish the level um, but unfortunately um, if you don't go high enough you auto hover over something and drop oh, okay. and if you try to go too high you bonk. Yeah, and there's something the like trying to avoid two invisible barriers that stop your progress yeah. while you're doing a hard thing. Yeah, and, there, and there's another auto hover spot later too um, in that in that wall glide, so it's it's actually quite hard. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Understandable. You don't want to just delay forever. You don't want to be Duke Nukem of Dragons. <gasps> That's my punishment. Wow. I do yeah, like you know, like, better like... than he is at his own game. <laughs> For sure, you know, like like the, 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 you have to we have to stay reasonable. Um, it's a uh, it's not really in the speed runs yet because it, because it is too inconsistent. Okay. This trick, um, fairly fairly new trick, uh, found by like a like a like a person called Kroxu, like who finds so many cool stuff wow. as a speedrunner and, and and glitch finder in One the spiral community. Devoted glitch explorers. Oh yeah, out there mashing their face on walls for everybody else's success. I don't have the time anymore. <laughs> the uh, the work spiro balance can only go so far askew. Yeah, you know, you know, it's, it's part of getting older. <laughs> but I, I I get like I said, I gave like a few hundred attempts. It's a very quick attempts, but a few hundred attempts. Yeah. Like I I did what I could. <laughs> your uh, your earnest attempts are, are are noted. At least I got the, uh, on that cool thing. I mean, you got the, you could just not showed it off at all and just be like, oh yeah, I didn't. I decided not to put it in the video. But, or know. like nobody knows about it, so I could have just hid it like a, like oh there's no trick here. Yeah. I don't know any trick. <laughs> but knowledge is cursed. Um, ignorance is bliss. Truly. So the, Fire truth yeah. must come forth. Yeah, just to like like continue to talk about the level a little bit itself a little bit. We have those gremlins. Yeah, they can be. they laugh when they hit you, but they also laugh when they when they kill a, destroy a jar for you. That's fun. They you just love destruction into, of any yeah. sort, really. They're Who doesn't? Gremlins. Oh. When they die, they drop one of the flame balls that they fire. It's uh, scary. Oh, are you going to eat him, Gremlin? What are you doing, buddy? I, I think you I think it's like a dog. Excite the dog to see its owner. Like, oh, yeah, happy, happy to see you. Daddy! To see you. Do the magic, Daddy! <laughs> it's shaking from excitement. Or neuroses. Jeez. He's just broken. Oh. oh, there you go. Hey, you're free. Hey. You killed your master! You killed your... It's fine. Your daddy! Destruction of daddy is still destruction. <laughs> uh, Spiral, you're truly a cruel creature. <laughs> setting these... <laughs> yeah. Uh. Killing daddy yourself wasn't mean enough. No, no, no. Yeah. The blood will be on your no hands. Oh! Secret yeah, Spiral, it's a pacifist run. Yeah, the sheeps are in stone as well. <laughs> oh, but there's an achievement downtown. for not using sheep, so um, oh. I'm not getting a sheep until we get to the end of the level. And in fact, there's there's you can see there's one more lion, very in the back there. Oh yeah. Oh. I'm gonna try and hit him. Ah. Okay. Like, but, but it does go super far. So the one more attempt, just aim a little bit higher. Maybe. Aerodynamic as hell, these lava balls. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Right in that's the shin. Good. That's gonna sting. Like the wizards, as you can see, they're 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 at the wand, they're just waiting for Spyro to get close to them <laughs> so the cutscene plays. <laughs> they're just like, should I pick this up? Uh, I know he loves to watch me walk pick up wands. Or like Spyro needs to watch like it's like, <laughs> like He other, needs to witness my wand like, love. Yeah, yeah. Oh, look at, all, look at all the ships! All ships! So many ships. They're so cute. 
I, I get why you'd freeze the gremlins, because they're, you know, entropy monsters. But, like, leave the little rams alone, man. Yeah, they're kind of cute. Yeah. Our bell towers have been invaded by trolls. You might be able to help, but you can't beat them without activating this power up. Oh, a special power up. Is that true? This, this is. It not only does it uh, like require 21 enemies, which is quite a lot, it, um. It's a new power up exclusive oh. to this level. Is it. Spire get a railgun? If only. <laughs> Honestly, in the remake, it, it's not as uh, impactful. <laughs> no, it lacks the kind of the build up and payoff of the original. Yeah, like a giant meteor fireball, and this is just like uh, <laughs> like sprinkles. <laughs> just give them the sprinkles. There we go. More souls for the soul door. Yeah. This is that final enemy at that house we were trying to get to. You should have said that last fireball, fucko. Spiral, you have freed our <laughs> I guess we're doing hey, speaking of gems, man. Please, take this orb. I foresee that it will help you on your journey. Sure will. Yeah, it's the end of the, and, and the, all the Winter Tundra worlds, so there's no more talismans. They just give an orb for finishing the level. Oh, okay. Listen carefully, Spyro. If you want to get back to your home world, hold that orb and recite these three words. Okay. Klaatu, Varata, Ni... Ne, nah, never mind. Oh. <laughs> Good Evil Dead reference, me. though. So close. Your Army of Darkness reference, I guess you want to be uptight about it. Ooh, I didn't get that one. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> oh, so now that fire. the power-up activates, suddenly the trolls appear. They don't appear otherwise, which is kind of weird. And they are in fact um, vulnerable because they're made of fire. Makes sense. And here we go. Ah. Who do you think it is? I think we get to turn into a Sub Zero. Yeah. Yes, we do. Yeah. Super Freeze Power Up. The first appearance. Not the, definitely not the last one. It will appear. It, it does appear in a lot of games. Um, but. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah! Oh. And we got a, we got some real cool blue. What's cooler than cool? Ice Spyro. <laughs> In the original, it was just like a, like a bad blue hue. <laughs> um, yeah. Also, the trolls were super creepy. I mean, you're right. They were they were creepier. <laughs> now they're just like weird little baboon monsters. Yeah. Now there's they became really hairy. Some reason. They got a very like Monsters Inc. vibe with the giant yeah. eyes and whatnot. Oh, it's like their little kindergarten here. Oh, you get a freeze to death in your kindergarten. Good thing they they stay exactly in the positions. Well, not exactly, but good thing they oh. <laughs> they're so helpful. He just had to jump there. They're just, you know, they're not naturally on fire. That's what the wizard said. The wizard put them on fire. So oh. they're in agony constantly. And then we <laughs> add ice to the mix. I don't think we're giving them a less tortured existence. No, you're just going to make sure that their cells all turn into mush. Oh, yeah. Ding, ding, dong. You touch my trial, la, la. Your life is now either fire or ice. Yeah, need Good need luck. Was great, and both is extra bad, so... I'm sorry, trolls. Also, if you're gonna get breath. frozen, yeah. I would like my mouth shut for that. <laughs> Ice breath is a little bit weird. The bells are also a little bit weird. You can, okay. uh, all the hit boxes, but you must be this tall to bug. Well, I'm afraid not. There's still one bell wow. left. Oh, it actually, get doesn't get in the orb. What if you gave me a bell now and just trusted me because I'm a dragon that I'll get the last thing, the last bell wrong? Hmm. We, we unlock the whirlwind for getting the first two bells, and you can get up here, where there's more trolls. I want to get rewarded in whirlwinds more often. That should be a hit. Yeah. Yeah. You have to be in just the right spot to bell, apparently. Also, this is giving me some very Breath of the Wild feelings with their... Ice pillars. Ah, uh, okay. yeah, sure, sure. Thanks, Spyro. I didn't think you could do it. 
Ow, rude. From the Cloud Temple's gift shop. I thought you were a wiener. But you pulled it off, wiener dragon. <laughs> I should have known you were oh, cool God. with your shades. <laughs> Time for gems. Yep. We, we want to get up to on that platform too. Ooh, those gems. Unfortunately, I oh. still not activate rockets. <laughs> That's awkward. Cold vision, not a thing. <laughs> and definitely not inside the body of a dragon. Yeah. So you just gotta like freeze him and then wait it out? Yeah, all we gotta do is uh, just wait. And we get the, the rocket. I tried to jump on it, but, but it's 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 a it's a different timing than the, the one in Shady Oasis, so I couldn't ride it. Real Wiggler, is there a lumberjack behind you? I there. Know. Well, if you want to know who he is or and what his function is, he will tell you very clearly, very <laughs> fast. Right. Don't worry. Just wait, <laughs> wait one moment as we get these these weird. I'm a secret agent. Oh. oh, I remember Agent Zero. Oh, you remember him? Yeah. I'm not leaving unless you hide behind that tree so you can't see. He's very forthcoming about being a secret agent. Um Yeah. That's perfect cuz no one would believe him. I'm a secret agent. <laughs> to my secret hideout. Yeah. Only members yeah. of my secret club are allowed to go there. <laughs> I'm not leaving unless you hide behind that tree so you can't see me. Okay. <laughs> That, that sounds reasonable. It does sound reasonable. He became, he became he's still dopey, but he has more features now, I suppose. And he is like stacked, like straight up stacked. Oh days. yeah, he's he's a he's a hunk. He's a yeah, just a mountain of man. This is somebody who roll all all strength and con and no int or wisdom. Yeah. Again, in the original, there were quite a few things we could do here, like uh, well. There's a secret hideout that's all the way in the back there, mm. but uh, this, we're lo locked behind these doors. Well, I don't like that. I want to go to the secret club. I want to go now. So, we use another tree. Many use of trees in this level. Thank you, trees. Those, tre those trees, they really shouldn't have put them there. So <laughs> we can uh, already <laughs> skip this door. Level design is just like, if we give you any props at all, you use them to screw us. Come on. Yeah, yeah. It's a thick door. They must expect some sieges up in here. Oh, yeah. From like cave trolls. Or Agent Zero, I guess. But damn. One more one more door. Well, I get like two more doors, but there's another door there. This is a this is a quite hard perfect hover. But uh, it's possible. Very nice. It's definitely possible. Still can't get through the door, but who cares? We can yeah, and in the, the, in the original, they would open uh, from the back if you you came to them, and also in the original, this this last door would just be open. But they corrected that yeah. because of the <laughs> mini game. They realized that people were not going to play by the rules, so it was time for scripting. So you make use of another tree. <laughs> More tree abuse. And uh, just a very easy glide up here, and we can get all the way to ah. the end. The secret club. Yes, his secret club. All his nice plants. Burn them all. They're apparently like plastic fakes. Yeah, they don't make the noise anymore. <laughs> They're made of asbestos. Oh. This is our throw now. Well then, it's our club now. But now we actually have to do the mini game still because we still want that orb. Oh, mini game! All so right. it's this is a. It's a, a tailing mission. It's a tailing mission. Yep. Exactly. He's a. You know, he only only can see Spyro at certain moments when he's actually like in a looking mode. Excuse me, I was sneaking ahead of you. Yeah, thank you very much. Um, so, so he's not just constantly aware of his surroundings, usually. <laughs> yeah. You want to be quick, because he closes the doors behind him. Wow, what a polite boy. Um, 
Also, he's got mad ups. Good, good vertical jump. Oh, yeah, yeah, he can, he can jump better than Sparrow. He may in fact be a refugee from his own like undeveloped video game. So what we want to try and do, we want to try and do some weird stuff and get... Um, well first, first we're going to just do the, the regular thing, but we want to get in that at the same time he does. <laughs> I don't want to wait. What? You managed to get here without following me? Uh, it was yep. such a labyrinthine path. How could it be? After all. Here. Agent Zero is the smartest member of the Spiral pen like Pantheon is not right. Um the, the, <laughs> the Spiral Spireverse? World. Spiralverse, yeah. Who is he a spy for? Does that ever get explained? Uh, maybe also Shady Oasis like uh yeah. like uh, the other two from, from Scorch. I guess they just export intrigue and skullduggery. Yeah, they're they're all human, so I guess so. Yeah, you don't find humans too many other places, really, unless they're goofy cavemen. You managed to get here without following. Yeah, the original, the like, you, if when you when you got when you got there at the same time, he teleports back because you're we were too late actually. But you you're already talking to him, and then you still get your orb, and weirdness happens. So we want to try and recreate that. Mega silly. It's a little bit harder because the door is not open like it was in uh, in the past. But no worries, we got this nice tree here. You can do anything with tree. Anything. Hey. This time you saw us. Wow. I mean, <laughs> I'm too fast for anyone to follow. We actually failed twice at the same time. Like he caught us, but also he closed the door, so he appeared like twice there for you. Yeah. <laughs> Story of also, my life. You, you can't go too early because he can see you through the door, the the oh. the walls and the doors. This fella. I show you mine. Show me yours. Oh, your giant majestic. Are those your eyebrows? No, it's just like JRPG protagonist here, never mind. Yeah, so we can't recreate it all the way. Um, but still, some fun to be had. <laughs> Plus, you get more time with the uh, Agent Zero. What more can you ask for? Yeah. Soak it up. Oh, yes. Magic time. No. Oh. Oh, it's yeah. magic time, all right. Time for goat estrus. <laughs> <laughs> Good night, everybody. <laughs> all right, see you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs> for more goat estrus.